what's up guys so we got the engine out here we're gonna go ahead and give it a quick clean quick wash got the purple power going um, so we're gonna just squirt the hell out of it and uh, get it washed up get all that grease off of it I still need to buy another oil pan for this but uh, we're gonna go ahead and wash it up before we uh, get to putting the transmission on and fitting it into the truck before we can make the engine mounts all right let's give it a wash and we'll be back all right i already did a couple passes with the that uh what's it called super super power or purple power um now i got oven cleaner on it so you guys can see right up in here the oven cleaner is actually eating away at some stuff hopefully it doesn't eat the motor <laughs> but uh yeah it's cleaning it up pretty good um and, and in reality i mean the, it doesn't have to be super clean for me i just need it to be clean enough for me and my kids to work on it to where we're not getting super filthy every day um yeah so as you guys can see it's almost clean I gotta buy a new oil pan. Um, look at that side. It's eating it away pretty good. So I got one more can of the oven cleaner. And we'll go from there. I'll give you guys a look right after uh, I uh, rinse this oven cleaner off. But uh, I'm gonna wait maybe another 10, 15 minutes just till the foam starts to come off a little more. All right. All right, guys, here's how it looks after we rinsed it off. And you can still see some, some dirt around it. Back here. But it's all in areas that, you know, we're not going to get too filthy. So, for the most part, it's fairly clean. I think we'll be able to work with that. But I'm still, I still have one more um, can of the oven cleaner, so I'm gonna go ahead and use it as well. Just to, you know, use it up. I'm not gonna use it for anything else. Might as well use it for this. All right. All right, guys, well, here it is all cleaned up. I think it looks pretty good. see there's still some spots that have a little bit of dirt you know like a little bit of grease right there but that'll be all right this way we could actually work on it and then you know sooner or later the the intake will come off the heads might come off for some different heads I don't know yet um, sooner or later most of this stuff is actually gonna come off and then we'll be able to wash it a little bit better. But you guys can see, you know, it's fairly clean. That oven cleaner did pretty good. So there it is. And the camera's not really picking up how clean this is. Um, I bet in bright sunlight it would look a lot better. So it looks pretty good though. I got the, the Boral 80 over here. You guys can see. So she's all cleaned up, ready to go. She's been waiting for this moment. So probably tomorrow I'll go ahead and you know grab the the cherry picker, pull the motor off of the engine stand, and then we will go ahead and uh, just uh, mount everything together and then we'll probably clean up this area over here I have to take off that cross member that's down there and see how far we can slide in that that transmission and motor before we can build the, the engine mounts for it all right guys don't forget to give me a thumbs up uh, leave me a comment 
and don't forget to subscribe if you are not subscribed already that would help us out a lot